Well, hello my friends, Alfred Taro, the Rebel Turner, and today I have a special turning with a very special guest. He's been in my shop several times, maybe three, four, I don't know, I don't know, I lost count how many times he's actually been in here. He's done a few turnings on my lathe as well. Name is Thomas Kuzia. And uh, he's a pleasure to have around. He's a funny guy. Well, today I'm going to see if I can do something a little different from what I normally do. And that will be sit back and watch. <laughs> Don't know what the odds of that will be. But either way, I'm going to let him select from the piece of wood that he wants to turn and what he wants to turn. Let's see how that goes. Well, <laughs> say hello to my friend Tom Kuzia. He's back. I'm back. And by now, he has to be a rebel. So I'm going to get him a rebel hat <laughs> while he goes in here and talks to you guys, I hope, and finds a piece of wood that he wants to turn. <laughs> be right back. He says he's going to sit down and watch me turn today. Well, I don't know pretty hard to uh, put myself up against some of the work Al does. Uh, I've been into uh, segmented turning more than anything lately but uh, to follow a guy like this especially I follow him all the time on YouTube and Facebook he's quite a guy he's a good turner and a good man uh, we're down here for from Connecticut for three months and boy do I miss my shop Whew. I'm going bananas down here but it beats ice and snow that's for sure and I'll let him edit the rest of this out mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. this thing for it. <sighs> I was actually going to use that to make a new headstock. Oh. But uh, I got rid of my welder. I sold my welder. <laughs> Tom, this is officially yours. Oh, sorry, my hands were dirty. That's brand new. Thank you. That's your much. hat. <laughs> I know it's not as meaningful <laughs> as meaningful as the, oh. the one you all sentimental stuff. Mm. Everything that was on his walls <laughs> had a story to it. So it was an amazing yeah. Yeah. person to so me. Uh, uh, surprising, yeah. this friend of my, uh, my brother's friend had more pictures with my brother in it, all from <laughs> Vietnam, than probably my brother does. Right. You know, like, I mean, they were mm. close parties. So, you know. And he doesn't forget. Right. You know, some people, you're trying to show them something in the following week or month or day or whatever it is, and they forgot everything you told them, you know. And, uh, yeah. That is frustrating, you know. Right. But, uh, so let's make a bowl. All right. So Tom is ready to make a bowl. <laughs> We're on the airwaves. <laughs> I, huh? I said I was not going to, to do anything with this. But, and, we, uh, and we all know that's not going to happen. <laughs> well, I'm not going to have anything to do with this. What do you want for my green one? Hey, I want you to flip the damn thing. <laughs> It will be tight threading in. Okay, so rather than do that, focus. Okay, that's how big I wanted the base that's going to sit on the table. And then you can still nudge it a little bit, yeah. one way or the other. But figure, okay, I'm going to go from here. The base is not going to be any bigger or any small, any bigger than this. And from here, just keep gouging it out to whatever shape you want. Whether if it's, uh, you know, uh, whether if it's a bulging out or whether if it's a concave, whatever you want to do until you get all this off balance. Off balance.
out. I can't get around here with this here. Boy, what a messy shop you got. You know? You dress them up, I can't take them nowhere. I've never heard you talk too much. Face shield, brother. Where's your face shield? Get that face shield on. <laughs> Ball bust <laughs> Yeah. 
come from. Except the lady has no crap. That's pretty well balanced. All right, this one is all yours from now on. Where are the snow blowing? I don't want to do anymore. So that's yours, Tom. You shape it, you do whatever else you want to it, it's still a decent sized bowl, and the wood will be a little bit better than that punky wood. Still has some checking. Again, that checking doesn't bother me, but it could bother you, but it's not gonna blow away. And it's not punky. Know what I mean? Yeah. Jelly bean. Yeah, it's very little checking on this. You can literally take it all the way down if you want to, but that's up to you. stubborn and fight it, or, but this is not going to tear up much uh, with this.
Well, it's pretty good. Yeah, it is. Uh, what do you think, Cherry? Yeah, I think so. That uh, white birch log I told you I had that was small too. Yeah. Name was Oscar. I had to call Oscar. But Oscar had a radio piece. Right. And they throw it over. Right, right. Same exact weight, height, everything was perfect. Now. Even they even added the weight of the astronauts in. Really? Yeah. Okay. And uh, we say that was a boom fitting for the kids that we could pick up. Our orders were to secure it, but not to open it. Okay. So we would let that thing go. Right. Ooh. Yeah, if there's every, waves every you can one see of those valleys in those waves, I mean Yeah. It only takes an instant when you're feeling it. Well, it's nice to be able to slow the legs out. Oh, it, it is. Yeah. Paper towel, I, I go around with it. I take a clean one and go right over it. Yeah. Almost the same size, Tom. Almost. Mine is bigger. Yeah. So, just so you guys know, whatever is not good, it's because Tom was working on <laughs> it. You know me, I don't, I don't make bad stuff. <laughs> Tom did an awesome job on this piece, considering this was really, really punky. I mean, it's punky all over the place. Uh, I could literally push this in and get this void out. So that will be up to Tom to decide what he wants to do. And this one was a uh, much harder wood, which I believe is cherry, but uh, uh, had some stubborn areas on it. I think every time I try to show off, <laughs> my, my show off comes true on the mishaps. You know, the good stuff is all under edits. <laughs> yeah, I play around with uh, Photoshop. <laughs> and that's it. Well, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Tom, you did a hell of a job. You know. Hi, everyone. Yeah. The so, master. The new rebel. <laughs> Apprentice rebel. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, you, you did good. So, anyway, that's it. On this. How much?